Mike said, so you cashing out. <laughs> Oh my God. Hospitals and jets have value. Women do not. Hold on, guys. I'm trying to get my... At least be able to see the live chat. Because I'm moving through this head. And not with my tablet down. Come on, there we go, there we go, connect, connect, thank you, thank you, how's everyone doing? This should be interesting. No, it's kind of boring. You just doing the same thing over and over. What? <laughs> Did I miss the joke? <laughs> Girl, she is tickled. <laughs> She is tickled. <laughs> I bought those drug red joggers from Amazon. Really? I got mine from Walmart for like five dollars. <laughs> 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 Somebody help me. My brain's working. <laughs> It's on the gangster lean. She's using all that jam and braids still tilted. She got more jam than braids. Oh my god. Oh my god. shouldn't be doing too much to it so um moisturizing isn't really hard to do um i just say keep it light and simple can't go wrong with water and oil uh <laughs> girl girl <laughs> i need you to calm your happy ass down <laughs> situation um if the locks are fully developed they're not going to fuse together they're going to always be separate um generally they only fuse um at the loose hair with the new growth so if you're trying to f fuse fully developed locks may probably not gonna work out i won't say it's not it probably is not going to work out Can y'all hear the? Is the fan blowing into the phone? Y'all just hear it going. I told y'all, I get hot. They are fully developed. Yeah. So, um, usually when, so the ones that are developed, are they developed all the? I mean, sorry, 
<laughs> I can't multitask. The ones that are fused, are they fused all the way through new growth and ends? Because generally speaking, when people try to fuse locks together, it'll fuse at the, the roots with the new growth, and then the ends will remain separated. The dragon tongue, or whatever they call it, the fork dragon, I don't know. Fork tongue. Fork tongue. Yes, thank you. Yeah, you probably should cut off one of those. Why does this look like Rudolph the Red Hook? <laughs> she do. <laughs> Leave her alone. Who the fuck is teaching these bitches how to apply makeup? <laughs> okay, so I got the fan right on me. That's what it is. Oh, let me stop. Let me know if that's better. What, that? No. Oh, well, that's they, yeah. Mm -hmm. So Girl, you were supposed to be going to sleep. I'm trying, but you I is can't not stop trying. Yet. <laughs> I should not stop laughing. <laughs> she is I'm trying to tell you, this shit funny. <clears throat> Y'all should have said something. What is she doing? I don't know. I'm just watching a bunch of videos. One of them's gonna put me to sleep. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Watch. Oh, she thought she did something there, huh? Hold on. Discord is down? Like, all the Discord? They need to get that together. Um, so before anybody asks, all we are using, y'all know, we use the hair grease, the water and hair grease, y'all know this. We switch it up sometimes. We're using, um, Royal Crown. Y'all see that? Yeah. What y'all know about that? That's what I use. What y'all know about that? I use that. This, this the heavy duty grease. Like, if yo. If your hair eats up blue magic, <laughs> depending on what season it is, that determines which hair grease I use. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Can you elaborate? In the summertime, um, Nature's Blessing works best. It's lighter. I tend to sweat more because it's hotter, it's more humid. Um, and my scalp doesn't suck up the grease that fast just because of the humidity in the air. Whereas in winter time, uh, my hair tends to be drier. My hair tends to, so sucking up as much moisture as possible because it's, it's dry. Um, so I usually wet it every single day and then I use a heavier grease. Um, and I wet it even after I put the grease in. Um, but it's just to help keep it moisturized. So I, I probably grease it probably like once every two weeks, depending on how I feel. How does it smell? Oh. Smell like grandma. <laughs> it smell old school. And the smell lingers. So if you. It smell like grandma. It smell like a black mom. How about that? Black mamas don't smell like this. They smell like um, cooked food. This don't smell like no cooked food. Baked goods. They smell like cooked food, baked goods. This smell hair like grease. Royal Crown. I don't know what Royal hair Crown. Grease. When the last time you've been up under your grandma? I never met her. Oh. My mama old. Oh. <laughs> she had me at uh, 38. My grandma used to smell like cooked food and hairspray and hair grease. Straight up. Did I meet my grandma on my daddy's side? No, mm-mm. No, that was, I remember who I met. That was a mess. Ooh, the braids keep them. But they did. Look at that bandage. Honey, look at that. You can tell her scalp is cooked. <laughs> Her scalp is like ashy. Mm-hmm. Her oh, braids. Poor thing. Her braids hella keep up. Her braids hella keep up. 
I have never seen that grease before in my life. Oh, you a baby. Don't feel bad. I hadn't seen it before um, Henny pulled it out for me. That was still in my grandma's drawer. She, too, she passed. She went to school for hair also, mm -hmm. and that was the shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Smells like under a grandma or auntie's sink. Yep. It works. It works wonders for You ever going to try that locksmithing on someone or yourself? I did it on Aaliyah. If you actually watched my last video of me, um, the locksmithing, um, I actually got the hang of it. Uh, I do it on Aaliyah now. Um, however, I will say sometimes it's still better to just go and wrap the hair manually because, like, huh? So they had this thing now where like when you have like a lot of flyaways and fuzz around mm -hmm. the lock, they'll do this thing with their hands where they roll it in like their fingers and their palms and stuff. Does that hurt? Hell yeah. <laughs> I figured that. That's why I'm like, I don't want to do that on everybody. But um, Aaliyah said it didn't hurt her, but maybe because you got micro locks. I don't know. I wouldn't do it on you though. Um. But yeah, I, I tried it. It's cool or whatever, but I mean, it ain't all that. Don't do me. Say that. <laughs> I don't she said, hell yeah, I wasn't even going in like that. I was praying. Don't do no new technology. <laughs> all this new shit got bitches bald heads. <laughs> My hair grow and it ain't gonna stop. I stick with old school techniques and last I checked, I got more hair than a little what bit. What age did your mother have a Leah then? She was 42. Mm-hmm. Maybe I had just because we're four years know. apart. So. They love new technique. Try this. Don't get it twisted. My mama ain't like no old lady. Like, oh baby, can you help me grip this off the top shelf, please? Like she ain't no. Oh, she got that skill to beat your ass. <laughs> <laughs> she do though. What's what, what's going on? With the heavy beads at the end, as if they couldn't find it. I, I just don't understand. Braids be braids are heavy enough, but then people want to find ways to make braids heavy. It's like women don't like having hair or something. They just they just want to find a way to make the style different, I and mean, it's I like do. everything's been done already. I get what they're trying to do, but like the end result, the end result, like. Oh. It'll be fun to have a grease sniff test to see who can correctly guess the brand of grease. Oh, baby. I, I bet I that. could. Oh, that might be something to do. We got a whole bunch of greases. Let me know, and I'll go ahead and send them over with you and Aaliyah. <laughs> and y'all can live stream it. Aaliyah don't know hair grease, though. I would oh, have to do it on be, you. You're going to be the one smelling the grease. Aaliyah going to sit them in front of you, put a blindfold over you. And put all the greases in front of you, and you would have to figure out which ones they are. You could do it on the live stream. No, I would make a separate video for that. No. Okay. There's too much going on on the live stream already. Oh. Where my clips go? Oh. Throw some pink lotion. Here's the thing. I, I ain't never really used pink lotion like that. How do you feel about pink lotion now? Who, me? Mm-hmm. It's oily as hell. Um, yeah, that much I did notice. It works on some people's hair. It doesn't work for everybody. You know what? Cantu came out with a product that was comparable to that like a while ago. I don't trust Cantu. They call it on work. No. <laughs> okay. No, it was like their oil moisturizer, and I used to use it, and it was like a thick cream, mm -hmm. but like you said, it was oily. So that's the only thing. Like, um, I use pink. I've used pink hair moisturizer, pink lotion. That's a, back in the day. I used the pink um, lotion. It doesn't work for everybody. It's too oily, and if you have somebody that already experiences like breakouts from excessive sebum like oil on their face and stuff you don't want to apply something like that because it just seems like that stuff just doesn't it's like 
it absorbs into the hair depending on if you use the right amount but then like that oil just seems to slide down yes it slide down your oh hair I don't know. I can see that. I can see that. Yes. It's like the oil content in it is heavy. Yes. Yes. I mean, it smells good. And like I said, it, it works for some, but you really have to use it and um, be, don't, don't be generous. You can't be too generous with it. And you should apply your own wet hair and wet hair only because if you use it on dry hair, it is the devil. Um, also, if y'all looking for inspiration on folks who retwist their micro locks, I know um, Alicia James had micro locks for a while. She's combined, since combined, um, her locks to make them larger. But um, what are we laughing about now? I know the fuck she did. <laughs> <laughs> she got real. She low key did it because of me. Yeah, she low key did it because of me because I was like, I was on a stream one time and I was like, uh, if you ain't enjoying your hair and if your hair is stressing you out, like, what's the point? Like, and I think I think she heard that and it like made sense to her at that moment. So she was like, Yeah, let me go find somebody to combine these shit. I'm sure <laughs> but I can only imagine how long it would take to interlock these, like, oh Jesus. Oh, That's why I don't understand people who sister lock, you got that sis. <laughs> You don't want to do nobody's sister locks? Nope. I used to do them. I ain't doing them no more. When did you do them? I did sister locks in like 2012, 2013. Oh, that's when I was graduating. <laughs> mm -hmm. And it wasn't called sister locks because technically I can't do sister locks because I'm not licensed. Right. But whatever. I'm about to move you out of this side. You can move me. No. They really got their job. These are called sister locks. Oh, okay. y'all about to be on. Wait, they about to be in your phone, maybe. They could be in my phone. They nothing on here. They nosy. I ain't doing <laughs> they could be in my phone. I ain't doing nothing but looking at videos. No pictures happening, trust me. You're going to see a bunch of art and videos. I should go watch them ratchet videos. Is that good? Let me see. Why does it not look clear? I mean, do I need to auto focus maybe? Okay, whatever. Oh, baby. Oh, y'all kind of in the way. Let me back y'all up some. That's intense here. You sure you don't want to just move the chair? Nope. This is perfect right here. Look at this. Interesting. I don't need that. What is this? What's happening? Look at the filter. Oh. Honey, who is this? Oh. Okay, that's a that, that's what he. Wait, he, that's not what he that's looks not like. What he looks like that. Okay, so this. That's what he looks like. Like, ugh, people just be wanting to make themselves feel low. Just ugh. I don't like these filters. Like that them. that's the filters irritate my soul. Take me as I am. <laughs> I refuse. I'm like, so you ain't got no pictures of you without you sticking this dog tongue out. So, and, and these damn filters making you light skin and got gray eyes. That's why Aaliyah was like, I want, um, I want contacts. I'm like, why? She was like, because I think I look cute with uh, pretty eyes. I'm like, oh my God. The anti-blackness. <laughs> oh. <laughs> when I was in my early 20s, I used to walk Y'all say it looked clear. One. Okay. I used to walk around with one brown eye and one clear eye just to fuck with people. They were, oh my God, your eyes really, like you was born like that? <laughs> yeah, oh you, that's exotic. Is it really? I just don't look retarded. Like, <laughs> I just, I don't look stupid. Like, no, this isn't natural, come on now. So you look, private school, private, they still, they really, this is really a thing. Women is really like putting prices on their coochie. Wait. See, look, private school, private hospital, private jet, private parts free. They really is that it. a song? I don't know. You want to click on it? Let me let me hear it. Expensive, private jet, expensive. But you want my private parts for free? Ah, yeah. Private. <laughs> 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 okay, so what you're trying to say is, yo, coochie expensive. And 
if you want it. You got to pay. Mm. So, do I pay a subscription or a one-time fee? Mm-mm-mm. So, like, is it considered, like, prostitution? <laughs> Asking for a friend. Like, that's different. That, that's different. I don't understand how the value's on the this and not on the this. Like Brown eyes are pretty, the fuck? Exotic. Mm. I mean, all eyes are pretty on the right person. And I'm pretty sure, you know, God gave that person that right eye color and it works for them. I just don't see what the difference. I was just so, like, I don't understand, like. And then some people will be like, oh, my God, that, like. That brown eye, because I have a darker brown eye naturally. Yeah. So if you have one light brown eye and one dark brown eye, it's like, oh, you know, that, that that's, 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 no, no, it's not. <laughs> that's a discoloration. That's a lack of melanin in one eye. The melanin didn't quite punch in this eye the same as this eye. Like, there's nothing wrong with people that have, you know, two different eye colors and stuff when it's natural. But it was just the way that people responded to it as if it was something much more exotic about it than just an eye color. Like, oh, my God. So we have got to stop, like, putting people in this. You're better because this is lighter. Is there a discount for an annual subscription? <laughs> like, 25% off when you subscribe for a year. Ain't that crazy? That Maybe that's the definition of a high value woman. No. <laughs> oh my mm -mm. gosh. Mm -mm -mm. <laughs> Somebody said private school can give give me new learning every day. Private hospital can give me extensive care that others cannot. Private jet can take me anywhere and happily without the frustration of others. And at my disposal, your private parts, your private parts be the same every time and don't get refurbished ever. Ooh. <clears throat> Ouch. Try the Yanni steamer. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Is that, wait, yes. so have you done that? Hell no, nah, I ain't putting no good. Oh, <laughs> that's a I don't, I don't understand all that. I'm not about to rest my coochie over no hot pot. <laughs> I'm saying, oh my gosh, it's going to tighten my cooch. Nah, son, I don't believe it. What? That. That's what they say you do. It, it cleans out the impurities. So cleaning yourself every day doesn't do that. Your body doesn't naturally just do that. Just eating Apparently and not. And drinking enough Apparently water doesn't do no, that. No, no. No, you got to put your coochie over a hot pot. And I don't see how a hot pot of steam is going to tighten up some coochie. If that's the fact, does it work for the skin? Like if you steam your face, does it slow down the aging process and, and keep the wrinkles from coming? Because if it worked for the, the, the coochie, shouldn't it also work for your hands? And your face and your isn't neck. Isn't it? Wait, isn't it more so muscles though? Like down there? It is. Internally. You better, y'all better get on and see people lazy. They don't want to work. They want to sit over steam pots and tighten the cooch. It don't work. Wait, so you got to work it out? Yes. Oh. You got to sit there and motherfucking mm, loosen up. Mm. <laughs> you got to lighten up. <laughs> oh my God. What? Someone said that doesn't sound safe. The the steam pot or whatever. Yeah, that... this it's a thing. Let me see the Yanni. Let me see some. I saw that. I said, hold up. They really putting their cookies over pots. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't the hot bath do the same thing though? No. Um. Yeah, I would think so. It's the same thing. See Yanni steam and Yanni pearls. Oh, y'all sticking pearls? I don't know what they sticking. Child, this this video getting flagged. If anything, steam loosens your muscles. That's what I, I okay. I thought it was me. Not here's a tip on inserting your yanni pearl. Lord have mercy. So y'all walk around with balls inside. Yes, my love. Oh shit. Huh? You trying to get the charger? Go ahead, get the charger. Hmm. Anything for a buck, huh? Did 
just be walking around using the Yanni Pearl and still can't find no man. Like, Ooh. That ain't right. I just don't understand. Like, stop doing just too much. Like, stop letting people play people. They be playing people all the time. People stay getting played. Here you go, the Yanni Goods video. Let me see the boom boom. First of all, why is the inside of the coochie black? <coughs> Why is the inside of the coochie black? Like, bitch, what died? Wait, what is that? That's the inside. That's the no, no, no. What's coming inside. down? The devil. I don't know. Is that time of the month? No. It says these herbal detox pearls aren't thirty to return for three days. Oh, this is supposed to pull out the bacteria and toxins that cause irritation. What are you doing? But don't don't you need to have some of the good ones? <sighs> You know what? I, I'm going to leave that alone. That ain't, go that ain't my ministry. Look, let's go live. <laughs> this ain't right. And, this uh, ain't yeah, right I'm just not. It ain't it. Oh, and look. The last time I tried to have a video on feminine hygiene, everybody wanted to dislike the video before I even started the streams. I'm like, you know what? Okay. Well, what they going to say to me? I don't know. Well, what haven't they said to you? <laughs> They ain't never said it to my face. That's what I know. <laughs> they can say whatever they want, but they ain't never said it here. Because then they would have catch. For Bell said, in my country, they steam after a woman gave birth. But it is interest interesting in the USA, people are doing it on the regular. What, what was the pur purpose of steaming after giving birth, if she doesn't mind me asking? Doing too much stuff for, doing too much stuff that real men don't worry about. Is something Westerners appropriated from African people? The steam don't know about the kegel thing. Kegels overused. Folks need to slow down. Stop selling the cookies. That part. Um, that part. I'm going to just stick to what I know. That part. Which right is here. here. It's for sale. Everything's for sale. Look, if you selling your cookies like you a Girl Scout, then hey, I do. <laughs> <laughs> that's not my business. Like, I'm not a Girl Scout. <laughs> it's your box today. <laughs> it is my box. <laughs> 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 oh no, I cannot. Mm -mm. Yeah, I just want to know what what are they doing in Africa? What what did they do it for? Because here in America, I just feel like people are capitalizing off of it. The way that they're promoting it and selling it, it just seems like a bunch of BS. I'm not buying it. I need to know what was the initial reason for why it was started. Because if it's supposedly for the purpose that they say that it is in America, I agree with Shorty who says stop selling the box and slow down. Stop in every Dick and Harry. Stay off the block. Stop being for the streets. That's what I'm saying. This is so cute. See, look, this is the stuff I'll be looking at. And then wrap your videos fall somewhere in between. I'm mad not a single one of them weird videos of white people calling themselves doing interpretive dance didn't pop up on my Instagram feed. Really? <sighs> You probably haven't looked at any lately or accident. I, I, I remember clicking not interested last night, so maybe that's why yeah. they'll, they'll wait and then it'll just take over my Instagram. I, I don't like the new Instagram now. Really? Like, I don't like, I like looking at what I intend to look at. I don't want to look at random shit that you want to suggest to me. Mm -hmm. Like... If I want to do that, I'll go to the explore page. I don't need you to tell me. Right. Who? What's wrong with him? Oh. He need to take his girlfriend out in some sunlight, cause baby, she is tasty. Oh, oh, oh my God! What is that? She is a mess. From, from the oh my the god. Look at this. Oh. He downgraded. He did. Like, and that's saying a lot because it's Kim K. Well, you know, she purchased, but you know, her body parts got better over the years, you know. 
So, I mean, she eventually became balanced in her look, but, um, yeah. Ooh. Yeah. He definitely downgraded. Oops, there you go. Shorty look like right up on me. Yeah, right up on me. I don't know who this is, but this is not. Hot Couture Global. Ooh. Have them on my page. Song and Haiti, they Yanni steam too. I'm told it's done after birth to clear out toxins and after birth. Isn't that what the after birth is? The uh, placenta? When the placenta comes out, the placenta holds all of the impurities, the toxins, and everything that was associated with the baby. That's the point of the placenta. And when the placenta comes out, the placenta usually has an odor to it. Wait, the same placenta that people be eating? Yes. The placenta, some, some people's placentas have a pungent odor to it, depending on the cleanliness of someone's body. Like, I got two kids. My placentas did not smell. And I've heard that placentas stink, but I know for a fact, I got two boys. My placentas did not have an odor. I guess maybe because throughout my pregnancies, I really couldn't consume that much food. And I was literally just on, for the most part, a liquid diet. But that's what the placenta is for. Doesn't the body clear that out by itself? It does. Okay, so y'all are saying the same thing right now? Yeah, it does. That's why I don't get it. To promote healing, restore muscle, and alleviate pain. But doesn't the body do that naturally? I feel like God, I feel like the thing that we, we keep forgetting to acknowledge is that like when God created or, you know, people even believe in God, depending on how, you know, people perceive creation. But when human beings were created, we were created with the mechanisms to heal ourselves. We're self-healing beings as long as the things that are occurring to us hasn't gotten so extreme that, you know, our bodies can't generate um, the cells necessary to reverse whatever has happened to us. But naturally, for the most part, we're self-healing creatures. So if you allow your body to do what it needs to do, then it'll, it, it'll heal by itself. However, when there are certain things that occur, um, there are certain things that, you know, we may need herbal assistance for. But that's also why God, once again, or, you know, whatever you believe in, um, created a planet full of herbs. That's why I'm not into, you know, going to hospitals and stuff. There are so many herbs on this planet and medicines, medicinal medicines, whether it's fruits, vegetables, um, plants, um, even grains that we can use to actually heal our bodies. So it's like, I just, I don't, I get the purpose that they're trying to do, but I feel like when it comes to childbirth, I feel like within the, the woman's body, there's something that is in there naturally that allows us to self heal for the most part. But I do know that there are circumstances where, you know, help may be needed. And under those circumstances, then I can understand that purpose. Like, hey, let's maybe do some steaming or maybe some herbal plants that'll help to heal and reduce pain. But just to be steaming, just because she had a baby, I feel like that's taken away from, I guess what somebody would refer to as the God in you. That's just my perception. But let me shut up and get back to these, these fly-ass nails. I think I want my nails done like this. Okay, before you do that, somebody asked, did you do anything with your placenta? Actually, I wasn't able to. I requested, I actually got into it with the hospital, both hospitals. Um, my older son was born in New York, and my youngest son was born here in Georgia. And they refused to release my placenta to me. What? Uh, yeah. They can do that? Yeah, they basically said that it was because of... Uh, the legal reasons, and um, I even thought to steal my placenta, honestly, but yeah, they wouldn't give them to me. Then we got into a big thing, and um, it, it, it got far. It got, let's just say that it got, it got really far. But um, yeah, they wouldn't release my placenta. They said because they have blood in them, and um, it's a... Uh, Biohazard? Yeah, yeah. 
it, it was a lot. It was a lot. Like that's why I said the next time if I were to ever get Okay, pregnant, well seal the shit up and give me my placenta. And that's what I said. That's exactly what I said. I was like, that makes no sense. It's a part of me, it's my body. You are taking a part of my body and you're telling me that I can't have a part of my body. That makes no it got far. There's no it got it got bad. But that's why I said moving forward, if I were to ever have another child, I would have an at home birth. I would hire a doula that's and I would crazy. hire a midwife. I would not go back to the hospitals and allow them to deliver my child because of what what I experienced twice with having to fight and you know them still oh well you know we've already disposed of it. Like what do you mean you disposed? Where's my body? That's a part of my body. So um, no, I wasn't able to get my placenta, but those taught me lessons. And that's why even for my sons, um, when they get older, um, and even my stepdaughter, when they get older, if they decide to have children, I'm going to make sure that I consistently advise. And even if I got to pay out of pocket for their spouses or even them to have a midwife, a doula, and an at-home birth, I'm going to push for that because, yeah, they don't, they, they don't respect the human body and the right to, for us to govern and have our own body. And that, that's a real messed up thing. Fabel, what country are you from? In my country, they buried the placenta. What? Whoa, why? My mother buried our placentas. My mother had seven kids. She kept all of her What the hell y'all going to do? Plant a tree? Yes. Oh. Uh. It, it's, 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 it's. Oh, okay. Yes. I'm going to be quiet. You actually said that right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm just. I know you were just throwing it out there, but yeah. No, no, no. I mean that. I mean that's the only reason I can think of why you would plant a placenta in the ground because, like, yeah, it's, it's it it gave life. You know, it sustained life. So why wouldn't it? You know. Yes. So, well, I'm good. Yeah. Uh, you learn something new every day, huh? So now I'm trying to. What can I plant in the ground? <laughs> <laughs> Well, if, never mind. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> See, women's bodies are so fascinating. Men are boring. We just our, our clothes are boring. Our bodies are boring. That explains why so many people want to be us. Oh, pull out, pull out, pull out. <laughs> Same thing. I'm just saying that. Explain that. Explain that. So many people that want to be us. The hardships that we go through, the the, the being a woman is a beautiful thing, but it comes with its ups and downs. And I would say the same for men. Very foreskin. Um. <laughs> Ill. <laughs> Ill. That just doesn't have the same. You know, okay. yeah. These nails are so freaking cute. I think the placentas are used for stem cells and medical research. That's what I think too, and I said that to them. That's exactly what I said to them. I don't think it's fair. You guys just want to use my placenta. You just want to, you know, test on my DNA and see what's going on. Let me see if there's a. W I can't mute that from here. Yeah. Nothing, my um. A little bot. I love her little short narrow styles. Oh. Um, does anyone have any questions? I know this doesn't tend to work out well while I'm doing here and you know, but I'm trying to kill two birds with one stone here. I'm a very busy man. And if I don't do it now, it ain't getting done because I gotta go get my skate on tonight. I know that's right. I could have to get it. My um I'm trying to be consistently active. Henny gonna have me drinking apple cider vinegar. Yes, join the apple cider vinegar squad. Brag, apple cider vinegar squad. <laughs> you will thank me. <laughs> I feel like I will. I feel like, um, you know. And lemon juice. Don't forget the lemon juice. Oh, you just trying to melt my damn teeth off. Nope, okay. nope. We Health is well. The lemon is the lemon juice gonna help with the flavor, cause baby, that brags. It does. Stinks. It does. Follow, uh, follow the brags with the. Are um, you an organ donor? I'm definitely not. Definitely not. <laughs> no, I thought I when I was first getting my license, I thought that was good. I was like, oh, I want to be an organ donor. No, the fuck, I don't. No, no. My organs are mine. <laughs> nope, they can't. No parts of me. Gonna play around with my damn body parts. 
Mm-mm. Now, if my sister need an organ, if Henny need an organ, then all right, all right. I'll be an organ donor. But just to be handing off? Mm-mm. No, no. I, too. I don't even like people like that. That part. <laughs> <laughs> I always thought about that. I'm like, what if I become an organ donor and my organ goes to a bitch that don't even like gay people? Like, I be thinking about shit like that. Mm -hmm. Honestly, I just, I don't don't want nobody cutting me up because a lot of times they still need the organ while you're basically fresh from, like, you're literally fresh dead. And um, from what I was told by a doctor and a few medical professionals that it takes the body at least 72 hours for all the nerves in the body to die so i'm like if it takes 72 hours for everything to die and y'all are cutting me open does that mean i possibly still feel what y'all are doing they say no but i don't believe that shit. that's why i don't rinse my hair with apple cider vinegar the smell makes me faint it's really apple cider vinegar is only really good for your scalp and that's only if you have like dermatitis or um, eczema and that's just to balance the pH of the scalp. All that other stuff people be doing with apple cider vinegar, team too much. Actually, that's what I need to do. I'm probably not gonna um, stream on my gaming channel tonight because I need to start working on this trends video. And I wanna um, do some research. So I gotta gotta actually sit down and do the work for the uh, edited video. Oh, oh God. Those king crabs don't even be as good. People be so good at it. Oh, because it's so big? I don't know what it is, but the snow crab is sweet. The king crab is not as good to me. That's just my personal opinion. Right. I thought you don't eat bottom feeders. I don't usually, but there comes time <laughs> when I break the code. You fake. I am, and I'm okay with that. <laughs> You're not going to feel it since the brain is dead. You wouldn't feel it if your brain is dead because there's nothing to send the nerves to the nerves that you're hurting. But is the brain actually completely dead? Have they proven that when a person dies instantly that the brain just dies instantly? Just because the heart stops beating, does that mean the brain automatically... Let me, now you got me about to look. What up? All right, we moving, we moving, we moving, we moving, we moving. We moving my tablet dying, shoot. It says human brain may stay active for hours after death. A A team of researchers have found that the brain works for a while after the heart has stopped. Well, there we go. Yeah, all right, I'm good. <laughs> and that's where they got it. Ah, ah. So suck my body. Yeah, yeah. Mm-mm. Um, I'm keeping it for myself. I'm a selfish person, and I'm okay with that. I'm perfectly fine with that. about the bump in the shorty. Her again? Mm-hmm. Who's she with now? Mm-hmm. That must be somebody famous. Mm-hmm. Actually, I ran into her um, last week. I just didn't say hi. No, I just didn't say hi. <laughs> <laughs> I told you, I don't like people. I know. That's all right. <laughs> People make you feel guilty for not speaking to people you don't even know. They like a celebrity walk by you. You ain't say hi. And do I know them? Do I want to go in peace. Don't touch me after. I thought he didn't do micro retwists. I don't, but I do it for my family. These are micro. Yes. 
you technically have micro locks. Yeah. You, you you can't have almost six hundred locks and it not be micro locks. Who said that? Who said that before I make a before I, I say said anything? that? No, no, not you. I'm talking about the comment. Who said that before I say anything? Is this one of your regulars? Yeah. Okay, let me shut up, man. I did say that. I'm like, no, I don't do that. Were you that lady on, on Facebook that asked if I do micro locks? Because it was a lady last week, and I let her know. I'm like, no, definitely do not do it. Yeah, or maybe a really sick child. Yeah, yeah, I would, I would donate for that, but. Nope. <laughs> Still not doing it. Well, I would consider it. Nope. Still not doing it. That's, and that's your prerogative. I feel like that's okay. Like, I feel like that's okay. My kids are the only option. Outside of that, I wouldn't. I don't want to see any child harm or pass. But I'm not giving up none of my. I can see her now. Damn, son, that's fucked up. That's what Your kidney bad. Mm. Shit. What's your blood type? I <laughs> was your blood type. Mm. No, I don't, I don't think I got that one. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Sitting there with the same blood type in the mm-mm. I just, I don't know. But you know what? I'm one of them people like, I don't, I don't know if I want, I don't know if I want somebody else's body part in me. That's something I think about. I wouldn't, I, I don't, I'm not an organ donor. And the truth is, I don't know if I would want, like, even when, um, I was pregnant and they asked me about a blood transfusion. I told them no. Well, what if like a part of your soul is attached to this person now? Like after you go. I actually read an article about it, which is why I said what I said. Because I met a woman and she had her husband's, uh, her husband died. And um, a part of him was given to another individual. And she said that when she met the person that um, received her the husband's donor body part, she instantly Could felt, felt him. Yes, which I was like, yeah, I don't think I'm okay with that. I, I don't think I want that energy. I think of, I think every part of who we are has it's more than just the body part. It's it's an energy that's connected to who we are. So for me as a person, I I don't this somebody else's body part in me or my body part in somebody else i just don't see me once that's real that's real shit though like that's that's shit that you really have to think about like Mm -hmm. people think like after we go that's it and you you go into heaven and you dance with the angels and shit but like i think there's more uh, i I think the afterlife is a lot more complex than we as living beings can really conceptualize and that's my fear that's all it is. That's my fear. I mean, well, look, we got all these damn ghosts and spirits and shit. Like, it, it got to be deeper than what we think it is. Mm-hmm. Yep. People haunting houses and mansions and places and mm-mm. Mm-hmm. Yep. People so have been stuck around for less. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm about to take y'all out. Y'all spirit about to go. To the upper room. I don't know. For me, it's just it's deeper than that. That's all that it is. Even objects. Yep. Yeah. Ooh. I call myself doing a soft retwist, but the perfectionist in me just refuses to do a half-ass job. <laughs> So here we are. Hours later. Let's go see if they posted any more of those. Uh... Why did you slap in your son? He's going to punch you in the face. <laughs> that <part. laughs> that My God! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh! What just happened? He caught himself trying to feed the fish. 
<laughs> Did he get knocked out? I what? Think so. What happened? Look. Some hit him? Yes, the fish. Oh shit. Look, why are you banging on the leg? Oh the shit. The hold up. Hold up. Y'all gotta see this shit. Play this shit again. Look, look, look. Why? In the hip. It knocks his ass out. And she banging on the blade, this dumb ass. Bang, bang. She like, I ain't going in that water. Honey, I'm getting in that water. I'm about to start karate chopping and kung fu kicking bitches. Like, get Sam out the water. The damn, what kind of fish was that? That fish said, get out of my space. Look. Sam, I get him! Who black mama was that? Oh, mute it, mute it. <laughs> Someone said a hot kidney. Y'all is dumb. Who said the kidney was haunted? We said the no, kidney. No, no, no. They just they just have a conversation. Oh, I thought mm -hmm. they meant like, like oh, no, it's spiritually connected. Let me hide in my cat in my apartment because I get in cells in my head or oh. Oh, or like what if like somebody was like real vengeful and spiteful in life and like they carried that energy in their body exactly. and then you take that on and then you wonder like why you depressed after the fact and why you just like you know what like if somebody's a manic depressant and they suffer from depression or, or or they're like schizophrenic and you like have that part in you about a part of them in you like, i i believe that shit about hair like that's why i'm skeptical about putting somebody else's hair in my hair that's just me that's why i told erica i was like because mm. she, she sent me a video i'm like mm. I don't know, nobody else's energy in my head, not even my kids. I love them to death, but no, keep y'all hair in y'all head, and I'm going to keep mine in mine. Like, I don't know. People just love sharing parts. No. Mm -mm. That's all. What's yours is yours, what's mine is mine. <laughs> if only we lived in a world that really believed that. Oh, wow. I don't believe anything you see on social media. Instant lock install. Wait, what? What you doing? Oh, look, that's different, look. Nah. They out here doing it. It's somebody in Kanye's I follow that does that. The Insta lock? Mm -hmm. So when somebody asks me, do you do the instant lock? Nope, here goes somebody in Kanye's. She must text. I would. Most of these stylists don't. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tax season. Look, see, you popped up on my feed. Now, this was posted two days ago. Why in the hell is it just showing up on my feed? Yeah, is that what I look like? Yes, <laughs> What? You got hair hair on your beard. Yeah. yeah. I was getting annoyed combing it out. That's really what it was. Really? I'm tired of detangling it. It 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 uh, tangles up so easily. I'm sure of it. You were still trimming it and stuff. Mm, yeah, only when I needed to. I so pulled you still it. have to moisturize it under the current circumstances. That what the happen. hell, girl? No, with your dusty braids. You know what? I don't want to even say nothing about them braids. <laughs> oh, he acted like he the uh, the skate guy yeah, cameraman. That is funny. Well, she don't just feel like they no clothes on at this point. I mean, she kind of has already. Oh. I mean, they be out there with um bikinis and shit. They do. Yeah, I've seen it. I mean, Sexy. I be out there in my little booty shorts. Like, don't get it twisted. I like. But, I mean, that's for comfortability and for me to be able to move how I need to move. Like, I try skating in pants, and I'm just like, it feel restrictive. Like, I got to I gotta be able to open my legs. I got to be able to do what I need to do. Like, well, not like that. Not like that. But you you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. Tracy Ellis Ross is my forever. Ooh, I adore her fashion sense. Is everybody getting these double piercings or something? Looks like a thing there. Um, the double nose piercing. Like on both sides? I keep seeing that. Uh, I'm not a fan. It's too much. I wouldn't do it. I'm trying to figure out how many piercings I want to get on my ears. 
I'm only got like six on each side. I'm not gonna do like any like any crazy stuff like the inner part of the ear. It's just gonna be like the outer part, so I'm addicted to hoops. Yeah, I saw this one white guy when I was young and he had a whole ear of like hoops going around and I was like, I wanna be like him when I grow up. <laughs> I think he also had rainbow hair. So now that I think about it, sus but <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's why I was drawn to him. I seen somebody get their ear pierced right here. I thought about getting it, but the pain just was too much. You ain't skating if you're not half naked and doing splits. Cascade logic. Mm. Mm. I, I can't skate. <laughs> <laughs> I used to be able to do a split, but nah. I can split, I just can't skate. I'm trying to hit a back foot. Fuck the split. They can have Everybody that. Everybody be splitting. That, that place be smelling like coochie. She tried to tell me. She was like, why don't you take your break off your skate? You'll be able to do so much more. Girl, get out of my face. <laughs> go, go get half naked and bust your split in front of the camera and leave me alone. <laughs> she just trying to People stay out. trying to tell me. Yeah, I mean, shh. Did she do what you did? They don't, but they stay trying to give me advice. Oh, and then they be feeling some type of way where I be like, hey, and I keep it moving. Like, <laughs> oh, you thought we was friends? No, I didn't. Shake, no. Shake those. She was like, I want you to get with me, you know, like, I, I'm working with this network and da da da. da. No, I'm good, but you stay doing what you do. I could not with you. <laughs> She was um, just trying to help her out. She was trying to use me. That's what that was. She was trying to use me for the visuals and to help make her stand out more. And, because there's certain things that you do that nobody, nobody else does. does. I seen you skate. My ass sat there and watched. I was like, and I quit. <laughs> they go over here spinning and shit. I'm like, you know what? Fuck this. One dude was like, oh, he came by. He was like, oh, can I record you skating? I was like, no, I feel very uncomfortable when the camera's on me. He was like, oh. Yeah. Yeah. Like, Just walk everybody don't want to be recorded. Like, it's weird. Leave me alone. <laughs> I don't think people understand that. Sometimes we just... Are in our element and in our art for ourselves. Yeah, yeah. I don't. Yeah, I don't think a lot of people get that. This we live in a society where it's all about before. visuals and likes and hearts and numbers and going viral and being seen. Mm -hmm. I think that's what I like. One of my problems is like I don't mind being in front of the camera, but when I act my most like outrageous. I prefer to just be in my natural state and not being recorded because my TikTok is not as live as I naturally am in real life. <laughs> if they saw the stupid shit I do in real life, they'd be like, this bitch is crazy. <laughs> so I'll be like, some things are just for me. Yeah. And there are certain sides of myself I don't mind sharing. Like, you have your YouTube channel. That's the side of yourself you don't mind sharing. But, like, anything past that, it's like, mm, I don't know about that. But like you said, everything is for the gram or social media. And there's no privacy anymore in the world. Nobody respects people's privacy. And it sucks. Oh, this, this, this food is so good. That's the pasta yeah, uh, thingy? The rasta pasta. Rasta pasta? Mm-hmm. Mm. I ain't never heard of that before. Mm-hmm. Where did I make that at? Right here over there. Um, Kingston Caribbean restaurant. Look at that shrimp. They split it all the way through and do that shit. He know what he be doing. He just know what he be doing. That's why he gave me that look. That was that. But you gonna enjoy this one. You gonna enjoy it. And he right. And we live in an era where people want to use your image without paying or crediting you. Hate it. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm be on. Um, talking about the part we're going to be talking about tonight. Oh, tell them about your uh, live stream. Can you tell them I'm eating? <laughs> <laughs> no, you have to tell them. Right, let, me finish, you... let me take, finish taking this phone. Who is this hit different? Mm. Oh, Jesus, be the best. <laughs> um, 
Wait till I finish chewing my food. I'm gonna we we got you. Right. We got you. Mm hmm. So tonight at 7 o'clock, I am going Eastern to. Eastern Standard be, Time. Oh, Eastern Standard Time. I am going to be live streaming on the Green Thumb Salon Instagram page. And we're going to be discussing um, energy, people's energy, clients, and stylists, and how energy can affect the service. We're also going to be watching a video um, about that type of situation. We're also going to be discussing color damage. We're going to be reviewing some images and also watching um, a video of someone who color damaged her hair and then we're also going to be um, discussing how people use other people's work and content to promote their own business without giving credit to those people so every wednesday i'm going to do my best to do an hour live stream i hope it does not run over but every wednesday an hour live stream where we'll have three topics and we'll just discuss different things pertaining to the hair community, makeup, um, just because all of that is a part of our industry. Even though our salon specializes on in natural hair, um, I am versed, I'm well versed in um, relaxed hair, color, um, makeup, skin care, and all of these different avenues and different platforms. I am not an expert in every one of them, but I'm well versed. So um, yeah, we'll be discussing those different topics. And then some days we just gonna be off brand and just talk about whatever we want. It just depends on what we feel some Wednesdays. It just depends on what we you know what we feel and you know, the content that I run across. So yeah, just um, if you're available 7pm. Eastern time. See, I remember that. Make sure you follow. The link should be posted in the description under the salon information. Mm -hmm. um, those of y'all that don't know, there's two Instagrams posted on there. It's my personal one, African Hair Guy, and the salon page, The Green Thumb. So it's going to be featured on The Green Thumb. So I was thinking about having The Green Thumb after dark. What? No. Why not? No. Why not? I thought you would support me. No. Don't associate that with the business. It was going to be after dark, though. No. Okay. <laughs> yes, sir. 12 a.m. Okay. <laughs> What's going on after dark? A lot of stuff. Why? Hold up. Let's see. Let's find an after dark video. Right Why it got to be the green thumb after dark? Why can't it be? Because remember, that's where we started. Lord have mercy. Um, what is going what on is, here? <laughs> what is she? What is going on? Oh, what is he doing? What is going on here? Oh, I gotta say, all social media is all about. Yo, this, you want me to send this to you? Don't no, 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 I don't know. don't no, want this time? No, okay. No. okay. I thought you know, maybe no. a little bit. Look, she has more hair than me. No, she don't. Yes, she does. Look. No, she don't. Damn. No, I'm sure. She just got more length. She just got length. So she's saying she did it in like... Two hours and 45 minutes. What kind of... Mm, I guess. She's I, interlocking, I think. I wouldn't trust nobody to do my hair that fast. Yeah, that's what I'm like. That's cute. I know, <laughs> I know how long my hair takes. I wouldn't trust nobody to do my hair that fast. They're cute. It's not on my head. Mm -hmm. Alright, fine. Mm -hmm. I'm going to do a TikTok after dark. <laughs> so you soak and wash your crochet hair before installing it. You should always... You know what? Let me go ahead and save this. Oh, lad. We're going to discuss that. Cleansing the hair. I'm going to probably make that next week's, next week's discussion.
like why you should cling to hair. And then also, oh, 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 oh. thank you for reminding me this video. Oh, um, I sent this to you. Uh, what is it? Um, reaction. You wanted me to react to it? No, no, no. I still wish to this day that I had that damn picture of Eric's uh, hair in the good when he had uh, the allergic reaction to color. What happened to it? His face ended up. Oh, you didn't up. take a picture of it? No. Oh. What? Yeah, I mean that's kind of, like who's thinking of that? Like. No, yeah, when let I me. I saw that. I was freaked out. He had pus coming out of his. Face. Yeah, let me take a picture of what I did to your face. Like. <laughs> yeah, that was like whoa. All right, I'm gonna let you. Hold but it. still, that would have been great to have a picture of that because people don't think of that with like hair color and stuff. Man, if they had seen that, that would have freaked them Ooh, out. Let me turn my things. A notifications off. Go off. Go off. Go off. Thank you. Stop moving. Stop moving. Stop moving. Got the way. Bump, bump. Let me talk about it. Y'all because I need to get up in here. Mm -hmm. All right. We probably got about, what, 150 locks up in here. Okay, boom. Here we go. See? Oh, I feel like I watched that before. Here we go. Yeah, I just want to see parts of it. I don't need the whole thing. Like I said, this is an hour. I'm about to bust it all up into one hour. It's definitely dry down here. Oh, look, that's my head. Oh, God. Oh, that's where we started from? Yes. Oh, shit. Look at my hair. Why would my hair be this much? Why is the screen so dark? I can't see nothing. Hold on, I'm going to brighten this up because this is... Hit the light. No, no, no. It's my phone looking dark. Oh, there we go. Thank you. All right. Is she talking about her allergic reaction? Oh, yes. That's when she had her allergic reaction. Oh, no. Remember Dawn used to uh, swell up real bad? From, um, I've never seen it, but I remember you told me. Mm-hmm. I didn't even put it her on her and, face. Her um, Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was crazy. Like, Dawn's whole face, like, it's like, I was like, oh, my God. See, I told y'all, uh, retwist on Microlox is boring. You're just doing the same shit. It's like doing box sprays. The shit boring. Yep. <laughs> yep. Not a henna expert. All this, it's natural. My hair dye horror story. Oh, tell them about the Gina chick. I can't. You can't? Okay, never mind. Never mind. She lying. That's all I'm gonna tell y'all. Lying. She ain't. She ain't. She ain't. She ain't who she says she is. Mm. She ain't doing what she says she do. Who said I can't tell no names, but I'm gonna tell y'all now. She ain't who she says she is. She ain't telling y'all. Gina, the scam. The real T. Oh, look at her. That the henna. It's showing that that breakage. Let's see the center. Where is that? It's not boring. We're watching the artistry. I I'm glad appreciate that. The lies, the lies. No, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> mm. I'm at the <clears throat> You can't stream other people's uh, YouTube videos, right? Um, I do it all the time. 
They just have, they may have music and stuff. How often? That's where it gets tricky. Curly perm, six month update. Shedding, breaking, matting. Sounds about right. Why I would never get another Gina Curl five months ago. Who said that? Somebody named Love Frenchie. <laughs> and then this girl, she used to get Gina Curl. Gina Curl, curly perm, six, six month update, shedding. Oh, yeah, her matting. hair was turning into whole locks. I was like, girl. Stay unique. Mm-hmm. How you got a whole Gina Curl and your hair locking up? Keeping it real and unfiltered about the Gina Curl. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You were still talking about some, it's not her fault. It was things <laughs> that I did. It was all me and my fault. So it just so happened all y'all got the same story, but it's not her fault. All y'all, a bunch of different women, got the same story with the same experience, but it's not the Ooh, fault. Oh, hey, Sharon from Austria. Like, stop it. I didn't realize Henny had micro locks. They're beautiful. Thank you. Okay. Almost a year and a half in. Oh, yeah. Well, actually, a year and a half of hair growth. Yeah, just a year and a half of hair growth stressing me out. I'm mm -mm. This is what you call thick density. Double thick. <laughs> Double thick density. Oh. Look, after the Gina Curl, this was three days ago, January 2022, after the Gina Curl, says, tell the truth, Shane the devil. Oh, now I'm going to have a Gina Curl watch party. Y'all should. <laughs> the pettiness. Look, two months ago, lessons from my Gina Curl journey. Is this the end of my curly perm? Oh, play it. I want to hear it. Leave the music off, right? Leave no, you can turn her up as well. Come on, sis. All right, she about to start, y'all. Oh, my back just started itching. Okay, she cute with them pretty ass eyes and nice lips. Oh, she need to take that lipstick off, though. Oh? She do. She's beautiful, just not with that lipstick. Girl, look a so hot damaged mess. <laughs> <laughs> this one's to so, be beautiful. Many people out there, you know, have different kinds of chemicals. I like this lipstick. Um, it doesn't work on her. It's not even the uh, applied. Uh, like you see how it's so coming off the side of her lip here. Um, I've done a few of those in my time. And the last one I have my head on my head now is the Gina Curl. So I've learned a lot, actually, from the Gina Curl um, when it comes to my own hair. I've learned a whole lot. So I wanted to share that with you guys um, and also to announce that I am about to shave my hair. Oh, By the time this video lands, uh, I think it will probably be a month concerned. since I shaved my hair. <laughs> like, I would have shaved my hair for about a month. You know. But in the meantime, what have I learned? Since I've had the Gina Curl, I will tell you, no lie, my hair feels stronger with a Gina Curl chemical. Uh, now, <laughs> the lie. When I did the curly perm like 10 years ago, which is a wave nouveau, my hair was so frail and fragile. On the opposite. Girl, your hair is giving me frail, fragile, and dead right the fuck now. <laughs> you don't stop the fuck playing. Like, sis, are we not looking at. Looking at the, you see that? At the same head. You see it? We see it. We dead. End of it. Is this, this is dead. And your edges like, is going too. Are stronger than my natural hair strands. So, when wow, I, it's the know, delusion. When the hair breaks off for it, I'm, not, I'm trying to get the hair strands. You can see the thinning. You can see the breakage. You can yeah. see the damage. What are your, oh, just yes, I can. Break it off. It, it's just, oh, wow. My hand is slipping. Trying to. There we go. For real? I don't know if you heard it snap. That's how much strength it takes to break a strand of a Gina curl on my head. It's um, incredible to me. 
this. My natural hair, and you don't need to struggle that hard. The Gina Curl is a product. My unchemical hair, you don't have to fix it. Fix it, Jesus. I mean, yeah. So it's, I find that very interesting. The interesting thing is that I had thought that, that would have been the case many, many years ago when I was trying to straighten my hair with a curly perm chemical. Because I felt like, because you break the bonds with a curly perm, and then you reform the bonds in whatever shape you want. You can reform them straight, you can reform them curly, right? So I'm like, okay, so it's not like a relaxer, and I'm gonna do the You video can't reform your hair straight if your hair wasn't straight to begin with. Broken, right? Because when you leave it broken, then you leave it vulnerable. Your hair strands. But if you reform them, and remember with the I'm washing my beard tonight. Of I've been trying to hold that for a week. This shit is... Mm -mm. Vulnerability right there. Every turn is a vulnerable spot. So when you straighten and you form the bond that way, you have smoothened it, first of all. So those turns that were vulnerable are now straight and solidified. You know what I mean? So it makes... Oh, my God. <laughs> is she for real? <laughs> this is what they teach her? That's what she told her. Who told her this shit? Can you she... You, I'm sending this to you. You're going to stream this. This is my request. Just tell me how much I got to pay for it. So you're going to pay for it. I put it in my... It didn't do anything to my hair. My hair didn't straighten. It didn't do nothing. This is ridiculous. So, <laughs> maybe you dried it out. But anyway, so my hair is stronger with the Gina Curl. But there is still the new growth, the virgin hair. That is whatever the heck texture that God gave me. Oh, wow. Oh. Which is weaker. Oh. Because it's not chemically treated with wow. the, the breakage, the breakage And they the swear it's not self-hate. So the the point of demarcation between the coil and the chemically straightened hair, that joint right there is terrible for me. It's terrible for me. If I can learn how to take care of it, I could do this Gina Curl. My hair would be going down my back. No, it wouldn't. Okay. It would never. I, would, I think I would go back to the straight variation. If I do it again, I'm going back to straight variation. And I'm going back to not having it straightened, bones straight. Y'all see her? Like, Look at this. See, the last place that I did it, it's, it's, it's not bone straight at the root. I absolutely love it that way. This is so that ridiculous. Way. It doesn't the curl delusion. as well, but I wouldn't be doing a curly. She is delusional. Anyway, so I'm reconsidering that if I do it again, if if I do it again, um, it would have to be cheaper than this though. Five hundred dollars is, you know, at a times it's not conducive. <laughs> you pay five hundred dollars <laughs> for that stuff, that shit. But you need so to get that, some money. That my hair <laughs> is stronger. Um, with the Gina Curl, I also learned that my hair, even in its natural state, so why is your hair fuller at the roots than it is at the end? Of my natural hair, you know, some that I had blow dried and some that you know just the braid out kind of look. I'm like, oh, it's not so bad. Um, I think a lot of times we have a certain image in our heads of what we want our hair to look like or what we think it should look like, or we're comparing our hair no to man. somebody else's, and of course, no man compare your stuff to somebody else's stuff there'll be two things it's either you feel you're deficient or you feel you're superior really neither of them are good keep to yourself appreciate what you got and handle it but you don't, don't wait me. what <laughs> of course but you don't right. so i realized like you know my hair beautiful as it is naturally that damn turn and got her mind clean mm -hmm. to 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 wash and and condition because cleaning and rinsing the Gina Curl every two weeks wasn't difficult. Because having to apply the product every other day wasn't difficult. Having to do high maintenance every... The Gina Curl is a high maintenance service. What the fuck is wrong with these people? I think her brain is fried. Like you said, I think that perm done fried her head off. Yeah, She's true. Tripping. She's like contradicting herself. Every second. This is crazy. I learned that and I also learned... She, she wrote this down like, yeah, this sounds good right here. She's so pretty. That's the sad thing. She's so beautiful. Hair, it is so soft and moisturized. It just feels amazing. So I learned that I can use it. 
you know, what this Gina Curl has taught me is that with my natural hair, if I paid attention to it half as much as I did my Gina Curl, my, my hair wouldn't be, you know, too difficult to deal with. Washing it once or twice a week, you know, I could still do it in the twists because, like I said, I learned from the Gina Curl that hydration is everything for your hair, not just moisturization, but hydration. What? And my hydration natural hair was is... dry and brittle. Why? I washed it once a month. Okay. Moisturization is the step after hydration. I had it in some kind of braid or some protective style. Not good. And then I'm going to them and be like, oh, my hair dry. Of course it's dry. You haven't washed it. You haven't hydrated it. So I learned that. Thank you, Gina Crow people. Thank you, Hair's Talent. I learned that. Okay. <laughs> now that I see, like this one I was telling you in the other video, when I haven't washed it in three days, it feels dry. As soon as I hydrate it with water, oh, beautiful, soft, luscious curling. My natural hair can do that. If I if I hydrate it, it'll be nice and soft. So I need to remember that and hydrate my natural hair more. So I've learned that about my hair. Also learned that, you know, hydrating like that is what gives us the strength and resiliency because my natural hair was brittle. Why? hydrated so my hair can actually be strong and resilient if I go ahead and hydrate it another thing that I learned thanks to the Gina Curl is that the type <laughs> of water that you have makes a lot of difference when you wash your hair when I went to the Gina Curl place and they washed my hair combed it with my three and a half or so inches of new growth and only the 10 strands came out. But when I used the same shampoo and conditioner, because I got it from them, and I washed my hair at home, and I combed it, you tangle that same kind of comb that showed me the same thing that I had. I get a fistful of hair. Uh, so my hair, I'm sorry, my I'm water, sorry. <laughs> has some chemicals or some things in there, it's not treated the way, you know, for, for hair, it's not, there's some imbalance in the water that is not good for my hair and my skin. I know that now. And so wow. I've changed yet my you say, Yet you're sitting um, here with gorgeous ass skin. Um, to see if I yet you're sitting here with beautiful skin. Okay, so that so might help. how long have you had your life? That's one thing that I definitely um, One year, five months. That, you know, my hair oh. does better with no. the softer hair. Not one year, five months. Water. Um, one year. Uh, where I went uh, in, in, the, in the salon. Yeah, one so I year. I don't know if they treat the water there or this that state, Connecticut, has you know softer water than here. I feel like they have softer water uh, than here in the oh my God. DC metro area. Well, but makes no it sense. is what it is. So I have to. <laughs> you know, certain areas have hard water, uh, certain areas have soft water. And, and, and yes, that is something that is important. But what I she is talking about, my head and she is just all over the board. Starts coming in, I'll see less breakage. Uh, again, I'm going to do what I've learned now about my hair. Thank you, thanks to the hair selling people and Gina Curl. That the salon uh, name doesn't even make sense. My, my how much money did they pay you before, to my suck off? Because this is the deep and conditioners. As she see you know, here, um, with dry, brittle, it do look dry. Hair. Um, but I don't know how long the I'm Your edges is going. I am not a natural hair person. I like chemicals in my hair. I just do. Wow. Um, wow. So wow. I don't know what I'm going to do next, whether I'm going to do a relaxer or I'm going to do a straight variation of Gina Curl. What? Or I'm going to find another chemical. <laughs> another chemical. I don't know. Oh, the hate is real. Wow. <laughs> this is, she's sick. I feel like I'm a chemical hair, a hair chemical junkie. The fact that people but can say this chemicals with a straight so face bad. and, like, not true. think anything right. is wrong is crazy. Hold on. Did she say chemicals aren't so bad if you learn your lesson from them, right? Oh, she double down. And if it teaches you lessons about your own natural hair. So, yeah, I definitely have learned a lot. Um, no, you haven't. You haven't learned a thing. And hopefully I won't have all that breakage um, when I start, um, when the new growth comes oh, in. I can't say I have a natural hair journey oh, because I'm not intending to do that. Last time I shaved my head, I left my natural hair in for like two years because I didn't feel like putting any chemical in it. Um, I'm, I'm not one of those that are, is, is so okay, I'm growing it for a year and then I put a chemical, I'm growing for five years and I put, I don't do that or I'm going to be natural for
for the rest of my life. I don't do that. I am pretty whimsical. I do what I feel like when I feel like it. If I'm doing it to myself. Okay, so we'll see. We'll see how things go. I can't promise you. She's you know, all over the place just like this video. Like, I do know. Mm -hmm. I've done my research. And if I grew relaxed, I'm going to use the affirm. Oh, because that makes a difference. Um, this time, I have to <laughs> the for my hair. Oh, most of this was great for her hair, it. but you're not using um, it no more. It wasn't too bad. But you're not um, using it anymore. And I tried the olive oil ORS. I tried that. It, that wasn't bad either. But you're not um, using that anymore. I like the firm fiber guard, the whole, you know, uh, concept of that. Concept. Um, <laughs> see, I'm Shut up. I use that uh, my hair feeling I'm stiff. Shut up now. And supposedly the firm fiber guard leaves your hair more flexible. So what? We'll see. We'll see. So if I do a relaxer, that's what I'm going to use. And if I don't do a relaxer, Her hair I'm don't definitely move. doing some thioglycid or whatever the chemical is called. Thioglycid, girl. Because I'm so <laughs> excited. I actually love it. So we'll see um, what I do next. But for now, tomorrow, I'm I can't help. She is so gorgeous. Oh, shit. And I feel so bad for her mentality, but she is so gorgeous to me. So you will see uh, a video of that also. So until next time, have a fantastic, fantastic uh, day. And uh, I'll talk to you later. Hair hug beautiful. I hope you get the help you need. The sadness. Here go the 10 comments. 4C hair and chemicals are a testy love affair. What? I'm a chemical girl too. I'm a DIY person. So I've been text lax and loving it. I feel like I'm finally learned what I need to for my hair to flourish. Just slow regrowing and started with lye, which was a mistake. Waiting for that to be trimmed off. Yeah, because there's a relaxer that doesn't have lye. That's the lie. Thanks for your transparency. I'm wondering if your Wave Nouveau was too straight, but in the day, or maybe your stylist didn't tell you that you needed protein treatments. She ain't listened to the rest of the video. Thanks for your honesty. Still on the fence with the Gina Curl. I've had the Gina Curl twice. I could not handle the new growth. Now I have the straight variation, but I miss the curls. It is expensive with products and upkeep, but it's low maintenance. Yeah, okay. Y'all, what? Okay, okay. Here we go. Let me let me send this to you right now. Hell, I might even just talk about it. Stressed out. She got my whole head hurt. Hope my whole head just hurt. Mm -hmm. Let's see what she did recently. What you do recently, girl? Tell me you did something to your hair. Oh, she shaved it all off two weeks ago. <laughs> One month ago. You can't make this shit up. What? Oh, my head hurts. My head hurts. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. What time your live stream the name? It's supposed to be at seven. Okay, bet. All right, I'm gonna have to get off of here in like ten minutes. Cause we gotta move. I ain't in no rush. We got no. We gotta move. I'll deal with you saying right here. No, we gotta move. She didn't had an afro wig since getting this. She done wore red wig since getting the Gina Curl. You ain't even been wearing your Gina Curl, girl. How to pick the best curl defining cream for your hair. Gina Curl Curly Perm Wash Day continued. Where she started, where it's going. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. That's so sad. It's so sad because her hair grows. And she just keep damaging it. My Gina Curl straight variation on kinky hair. When you're looking for self-love at the bottom of a jar relaxer. And her hair grows so <laughs> thick. That's the crazy thing. Like, her density is so thick in its natural state. That is, like, the craziest thing. She genuinely and truly cannot see. But, I mean, look, she wearing... She, she, she genuinely and truly just cannot see that her hair is better off in its natural state. I'm telling y'all, this shit is all psychological. That natural hair ain't hard to do. It ain't hard to manage. It's your mindset. Hold on. Let me see. Cornrow tree. Cornrow tree. Oh, let's find her natural hair before she touches it. Let's see if we can find this. She, she, she's a chemical queen for real. She ain't lying. My hair is like goat poop. Huh? 
She put that? Yeah, she did. What? The title is My Hair is, my is hair Like Goat, goat Poop. Of course, I haven't touched goat poop before, and I'm never going to touch it. And thank you. Wow. Like goat poop. Thank you very much. Look how much hair thank you. Look how much hair that is thank you. Thank you. beautiful. <gasps> she really put the shit. Hold up. Go back. She Dude, put the goat I'm shit next to her hair. Like I'm Just done. I, I, I cannot. I, I cannot. Like the density, you could tell she her hair grows thick. Like... Her edges have been an issue for her for quite some time, but her natural hair and it's what the thing, comments say. Please, to wear for it was only seven of them. Oh, it was only seven of them. Like it's so sad. Like when when a woman is so beautiful and they cannot see it. Like, and and her comment, the what the heck did God give me? Like he gave you what he saw fit. Like that's, and her. You know what? I ain't gonna, I ain't even gonna mention that. We're just going to walk away from the rest of that. It's the self-hate. We can't leave her like that. Yes, you can. Sometimes it's best to leave people where they are. She and needs help. She don't want no help, baby. I know, but... She done checked out a long time ago. She has accepted... Most of her videos, she got wigs on. She... Most she, of her videos is wigs, and they ain't no good wigs. They're the African wigs. No disrespect to the Africans. But, um... Yeah, um Oh my god. Yeah. Uh that's somebody's mama. Somebody's yeah. auntie. Yeah, she teaches somebody to hate themselves. Somebody cousin. Yeah, poor poor lady. I wish her the best. Just, I sent you just look how much work we have to do as a people. Like, we're not done. Like, just because we got some cute little natural hairstyles and some products on the beauty supply stores, shelves, like, that, we're, like it's, we're not done. Like, we that's still have so sad. much work to do with ourselves. That's just so sad. Like, how much she gets, like, like for herself? It's uh She said so many negative, unnecessary things. Hey, Veronica. Don't save her. She don't want to be saved. Don't save her. <laughs> oh my she God. Don't wanna be, I want to be saved. <laughs> All right, yeah. I'm going to do this this one row, and then we going to end the stream here so I can get us out of here in a reasonable time. We've been at it since, like, when? Mm -hmm. uh, two? Yep. And then we took our break. Yeah. And then we ate, and then we got back to it. But I, I am moving faster. Yeah. Um, I don't even know the difference. My ass is numb. That's all. Oh, see, that's that's why we gotta go. We I gotta mean, go. you good? It ain't you. No, it's just. It's all good. I, I mean, I know I got a lot of hair. It's to be expected. That's why I'm gonna see you in about three to four. Oh, somebody else chopped off their Gina curl. A lot of big chops. New Year's resolutions. <laughs> chop chop chop. <laughs> chop 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 chop. Natural looking hair with the Gina girl. Not natural looking. Natural looking? That's so crazy. You could tell in this picture, like, it says, I got a curly perm on my 4C, uh, wow. 4C hair. Look at her before. This was four days ago, seven months ago. Like, and wow. then this is her after, and it's so crazy. Like, she she went from natural self, mm. and she's beautiful. She went from natural self with beautiful natural hair. She done put a whole filter, to filter, look, look, mm, everything, makeup. To, to match her wig. The, the, the filter matched the wig. Fake, fake, and more fake. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Look, eight years ago, the new and improved. So she, so she improved it, huh? I don't see nobody updates in for real life, though. That's the real question. Where are y'all updates? It's so amazing. Where's the updates? Everybody's update is of them cutting our <laughs> cutting off their hair. Yo, you gotta make a guest appearance on my watch party. <laughs> Just let me know. Man. Just like. Just call in, like, request the video, and then we go watch it, and then you just go call in. I got you. <laughs> I got you. I bet. 
Let's twist out. Dude, they stressing me out. Jeannie curl on fine hair, baby. She look like, what the hell happened? Ooh. Gina gonna flag a thief. Bitches talking about me again. She can't flag look, me look. as long as I don't use her video. That's the only reason she got my ass before. Oh, because you used her video? Mm-hmm. Literally, like, like two minutes. <laughs> Mm -mm. It's cool. It's cool. And they out here, they out here dropping these coins, honey. And then they want to complain about these prices. You out here stealing our techniques, but then you got a problem with me using two minutes of your video on my live stream. Oh, okay, sis. Mm -mm. All right. They ain't stealing our coins. That's look. They can have them. They can have them. These these women. I'm, I just. I just want to wrap I'm going to dedicate arms. a whole stream to Gina just for that. You want to dedicate a whole stream? Yeah, let's watch all the Gina Curl videos. You should. <laughs> and just make sure after you... Where the fuck is the update, sis? <laughs> Where's the update? You not going to show us how them fucking products work? Huh? You not going to show us them dry-ass drop-down curls, bitch? Where's the fucking updates? Huh, juicy head? Let's go. <laughs> Hair's talent. Uh, where is that? Wait, I just got it. Is this supposed to be a play on words? Like, here's talent? Like, it is. It is. Wait, it still don't make sense, though. It doesn't. Because <laughs> she, she, she can't. She can't do no harm. But you know what? That's what happens when... Where's the talent in slapping on chemicals? It ain't none. You know what? On that note, we gonna pull out, y'all. <laughs> thank you so much for watching and tuning in sorry i couldn't answer all the questions um but hope y'all enjoyed our little live stream here i will see y'all tomorrow on the next watch party enjoy the rest of your day and be blessed be